How about that? Boris said, looking great. That 09 Zaxby's car. Roger, they want you to go into cutoff of turn seven. Cutoff of turn seven. They want you to Tell you what, if Boris wins this race, he's needed this for a long time. Here's another guy that's trained all these drivers. Oh, there goes Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick off. He trained a lot Back of drivers, off. Boris said did. Was running fifth, Fitzpatrick. Max Pappas trying to charge in, and that always present 32 car. Villeneuve in third. Oh, listen to the Quebec fans cheer. Max Pappas is going to get to Boris said. Willie put a bumper to him. You never know. There is Robbie Gordon and where he has parked his car. To the white flag, last lap at Montreal. Even if the caution comes out, the race will be over, the field will be frozen. Pappas looking to close in. If they tangle, the 32 will try and pounce. Oh, watch the little bobble bounce in. No, it's close. Oh, man, look at Villeneuve pushing hard. for second, Villeneuve. Can he stay there? No, Pappas gets back by. Now Pappas has to try and chase Boris Sed back down. And that's just what Boris Sed needed. Let those guys race, let him get out of Dodge. And he pulls about 10 car lengths on him. Turn eight and turn nine. There's Robbie Gordon's car. As the driver walks away. This has got a good turn 10, Andy. Yeah, he did a good job getting down in there. I was wondering if he was going to be able to get in there without wheel hopping. That's the key right there. I believe he's, he can hold him off through these next two corners. Remember, it was the last corner of the last lap last year. One little mistake that cost Marcus Ambrose right, the win and allowed Carl Edwards to go here right. Go. Here's Pappas inside of Boris. He got him. him. Boris going to try the crossover. Clear, clear. Pappas over the curves. Here comes Boris. To the finish line, side by side. Who's going to get here first? It is, I think, Boris. Boris said. I think he got him by a bumper. Unreal. Boris said wins by a bumper. You're exactly right. Total finish there. Wow. I know NASCAR will go check the photo finish camera nice on that job, one. Boys, it was that you. close. You guys did a great job. It sure looked to me like Boris said got there by the width of that front bumper on that car. What a finish. Check it out. Man, what a move Max Pappas put on Boris said getting into this, these two corners. But then he hopped the curb coming out of that corner, and Boris got to his inside, and it was a drag race from there. Same thing we saw last year with Marcus Ambrose and Carl Edwards. And from oh, the photo finish camera, it is indeed Boris said a winner in the Nationwide Series, finally. How do you say it, Alan? Boris said just broke Max Pappas's heart. Yeah. Yeah. How about that one, Vince? <laughs> I was Scott Zipidell, and he just said, I can't believe it. Your first race is the crew chief with this group. How does it feel to be a winner first time out? Uh, it feels awesome. This team deserves it. Um, you know, I've been doing this for a lot, for a lot of years and a long time, and worked with some, a lot of different people. And I tell you, this team is is they dig, they work hard, they're they're fighting to to survive and stay in business. And when you get a good team like that and a, and a talent like Boris said and uh, Zaxby's on the hood, you know, Roush Yates gave us a good motor and then uh, Performance Friction gave us the whole brake package. Guys worked real hard, and it's just a great day. I'm just I can't be happier. With all the twists and turns this race took, including the passing back and forth there on the final turns. What's going through your mind as you're watching it? Um, you know, you just watch. There's nothing you can do. I, ha I have all the, the, the confidence in Boris that he's just he's been a complete pleasure to work for. He's so methodical and so smart. Um, it's just been a pleasure all weekend. Really happy for the whole team. Congratulations. Thank you. I appreciate it. Alan. Great to see you for Scott Cipidelli.
And great to see for Boris said, and what about the show at Montreal again? Unbelievable. <laughs> I mean, what you, you really thought, I really thought Max Pappas had this thing won going in the very last corner. Great job trying to outbreak him. Yeah, I don't know exactly how Max Pappas got by Boris said because Boris got off the hairpin real good up that straightaway. I thought, well, he's got it from here. And before they got there, Max Pappas had the lead. I was just thinking watching that, that Boris saw Max driving so deeply into that corner that he knew he wasn't going to make it. And he said, all right, I'm going to let him go and I'm going to cross over. But then Max made it better than he thought until he hopped that last curb coming out of the corner and Boris was on the gas well, and that, got alongside him. That last curb is very tall. Oh, yeah, he knows. Tell you what, if I was those guys, I'd, I'd be down there wanting to cut that thing down a little bit. That has just been a real thorn in a lot of people's sides. Listen to the fans. here in Montreal and if they stayed for the finish of this one and they all did boy they got their nickels worth photo finish Boris said and Max Pappas two of the best on road courses and they put on a show in that last lap and came to the finish line side by side well, they did what about Jacques Villeneuve I mean that move he made trying to get past Boris said and yeah. a great move Max Pappas trying to pass him too and back to what you said before, Rusty and Andy, you just have to be so happy for Boris. He's helped so many people better their careers and better their road racing skills. And all Boris has wanted to be for the last, what, five, ten years is a NASCAR driver. And now he's, he's a NASCAR winner. He's, now he's a winner. There you go, Andy. Way to go. Third place for Villeneuve today, Vince. Wow, what an incredible run. You look at the damage on the front of this car and all over this car. Great effort today, Jack. What was the difference between first and third today? Uh, just uh, the car was quick enough, uh, and uh, one, one lap to go. Uh, I thought I had Papis. That's the one I was wanting to uh, to get because he was uh, late on the brakes, and uh, I knew that Boris uh, was braking a little bit, little bit earlier. And uh, but yeah, I didn't make it stick. So uh, too bad because the car was running strong all race. The brakes lasted. Just wasn't as good at the end of the race as it was early. Uh, that's about it. We had a strong effort from the Dollar General team. Uh, I think we're great this weekend. Gave him a thrill. The fans were on their feet as Jack pulled it in here to pit lane. Third place, Shannon. Yeah, Vince, the team down here giving Max Pappas hugs. Great finish for you guys. We could feel how bad and how hard you were fighting for that win. What are your thoughts on the day, Max? I mean, first, uh, congrats to Boris. You know, if I couldn't win, uh, you know, he deserved a win. You know, Delana and Kevin, you guys gave me a great car. The rim car was super fast. And, uh, I mean, I gave everything I had. I believed until the last corner. I really outbreak him really hard. And, uh, I mean, it come down to the last corner, it, you know, I, I did all I could, you know, I went through the gear, I barely hit the chip in second gear and it went by again and I was there pushing in the car, but uh, I mean, this is, uh, this is what I can do in a good car and I'm really proud and uh, thank you, Kevin, thank you, Dee, for the opportunity. Congratulations, Mac Pap Max Pappas, great finish for this team. Alan? Well, there it is, right side of the screen, Pappas 33, Boris said in the 09, their fantastic fight for the win coming right down to the finish line, and Boris said is a NASCAR winner, finally. And the words out of Boris said's mouth, finally, a winner in the Nationwide Series. What does this mean to you? It's unbelievable. I mean, uh, I've been trying so long, and this race is so tough, and it was all about brakes, and thanks to Performance Friction for giving me the best brakes in the thing, and it just was uh, unbelievable. I just couldn't, I didn't know I won because I didn't have a radio at the end, but, you know, these guys did a great job, Performance Friction Brakes, Zaxby's thing, Zaxby's Fried Chicken, and it was just awesome. What was it like racing Max Pappas there? coming to the checkers well he went in deep and i thought Ooh, well all right i'm second but it was good racing really clean racing good racing max is a great guy and that's great for ivy benton and all the rab crew you've said before that you felt a little bit guilty that you've given all your tricks to everybody else in the field it certainly seems like you saved some tricks up your sleeve yeah i mean uh, we just really played it smart and uh you know saved our brakes at the end and we had a good car at the end and, that, and that's what it took congratulations thanks a lot Boris said, a nationwide series winner, and as he said, finally. Alan? 